Ten! 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 Yes! We did it! Surgery and simulation is a great combination. Combination. More, please. I got so excited that I couldn't even speak. Ten! Ty Dillinger right there. That's gonna sell my units. We need research points so bad. New office? Uh, maybe later? Not yet. Not yet. I'm gonna wait a little bit. Sales record, yes! I just outsold your game, dude! <laughs> Holy shit. Marketing. That's what we needed. Utter Games has received... <laughs> Utter. <laughs> I thought that was funny. Because it's like a bladder, but... It's more like a stomach, isn't it? I don't know what I'm saying right now. Under Games! In the two months, this will be taken off the market. Alright, bye Commodore 64. Nice knowing you. I'm all tongue-tied and twisted here. Alright, now it's marketing, so we can have money to sell our games. Promotion is a big deal in the world of technology. Goodbye. Game is off the market, generating one million sales! I think that's, that's definitely... A record. Pick topic. We never made a Wild West game, did we? I don't think so. Wild West RPG. Platform. The Nintendo. You just missed. We got our first 10, 10, 10, like 1 million sale game. It was uh, Operation Bladder Control Surgery Simulator. Sold really well. We did really good on it. This time we're going to make a Wild West RPG. We're going to call it Red Greg Redemption. You don't want to mess with uh, Red, Red Greg, alright? It's for everyone. It's 2D. <laughs> Development stage. Alright, RPG needs story. But it also needs gameplay. But it also needs engine? I don't know about that. I don't know about that. I don't know about that one. Commodore 64 is no longer supported. You've released two games for the platform and earned a total of $201,000. So... That's uh, something for you, for everyone to know. Dialogues, like halfway. Level design, like almost the same. Red Dead was action art RPG. Well, you know what? It's this is fantasy. It's fantasy. This is a fantasy world we're in here. It had uh, some RPG elements to it. But yeah, you're right. It's uh, open world action, I guess, is what I would call it. That's what Rockstar does really well. They're making the new one. The new one should be good. Uh, I know a guy that works for Rockstar in code development, and he's working on Bully 2. So there you go. Some in insider information. I'm going to have all those about equal. We'll see how it does. I feel like our design and technology isn't going as high as it could. I'm going to finish that right away. It's Red, Red Greg Repemption. Alright? We don't need to spell it right. We just need to sell it right. If you understand what I'm saying here. Like who would buy this? It's gonna it's gonna sell well too. <laughs> it's 
It's all about the memes and the dreams right here on my live stream. They achieved a great balance between technology and design. A nice experience. Here we go. Now we're selling the money makers. <laughs> that leak. It's not a leak. What are you talking about? <laughs> It's not a leak. They they just will deny that it's coming out until they are ready to announce it. I don't see why that's like a big surprise to anyone. I told people they would make a bully too. It would just take a while because Rockstar is really slow <laughs> at like developing new content. And they've, they've been working like... They spend most of their time doing uh, DLC for GTA. Do we want a new office? Yeah, let's move. Let's move out of here. We can get employees now. It's our new office. Under games right here. World class development team. Fill position. Let's hire some people. Staff management training. Alright. Staff management. Okay, now we can we can train people, which is important. Which will help things move faster as well. And... And we have marketing, which we didn't use on that last game, but we will use on our next game. Because now we're like a big studio, or a bigger studio, I guess, right? To a YouTuber. I don't, it's not like that big of a deal, man. It's just that their current main focus is Red Dead Redemption 2. And GTA DLC. It's not like a leak. It's something that's like... It made them more money than they expected it to. So, of course they would make a sequel. Because they have so much money. Rockstar makes stupid money off of GTA. Like, uh, it's not even... Like, even if the game sells no copies, they're not losing. GTA 6. Well, I think that's going to be a couple years from now. And, uh... I would not expect them to move on to another GTA that fast, to be honest with you. Rockstar, is, again, is really slow at development. But it's because they make good quality stuff. Like, their storytelling is really... Everything... They, their storytelling, production, game value, game production, their trailers are really good. Everything they do is really good. Their problem is that their speed is really, they're like slow as fuck with everything they do. Like updating and uh, giving people information, they're like really slow. Probably not till 2020. Or 2022. Yeah, I could. it's going to be a while. It's definitely not like something they want to rush into. Because if they can still make money off of the DLC for GTA 5, why would they rush into it? Uh, complex algorithms? One of these is for research. And one of these is for... I think this one, the third one is for research. Pretty sure. Yeah, see how it's blue? It's a blue number. Do we want Clara? I feel like this guy's better. Clara seems better. Let's hire this person. Here she is. We have to train her. Hold on, staff welcome training. Da -da -da -da. It's our first employee. We have to train her how to do her job. Okay, now we have a vacation bar here. So when this is like all the way to red, you have to send them on vacations. Okay, so this is uh, training options. 5 RP... It, but it'll help him, like, here's here's my stats here. They're all equal right now. I want my speed up. I think this one's speed, right? One of these two is speed. Let's 
Yeah, this one is speed. Alright. I think it just goes down on the list. Let's spend we're spending my research points on training right now. So her speed is really slow. Like it's one ninety four and her technology is really slow. So we want her technology up. So we're gonna train her and it should give us a plus Oh, that's research. Okay, so maybe it's not the way I thought it was. He's getting both. And she's just getting research. Okay. So we have to figure out which ones are do what. Because I want our technology up. But we can uh, hire somebody that specializes in technology as well. Oh, here's the Sega Genesis right here. That's one of my favorite consoles of all time. I had the Genesis. All my friends had the N64. I was the only kid in my town that had a Genesis. And I was like... You guys don't know what you're missing. Like, I understand that GoldenEye is the shit, and N64 had no mercy, and, like, awesome games, but... Man, you were missing out on, like, Zombies Ate My Neighbors, and Sonic, and shit like that. Earthworm Jim. Fucking Jurassic Park. It was some good... Sega had some good games, alright? Speaking about good games, do you think we can, uh, develop a game here? Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's go with a hospital. That's the only one we haven't done. So let's fucking go crazy. How about an action? No. I feel like simulation is the only one that works well with any of these. Prison. Prison gives us options. Let's go with that. Prison gives us a lot of options. We're going to have no research. Here we go. Okay. Let's do it. Let's do a prison... Prison adventure? Sega was the back pain of Nintendo. Uh, for a while. For a while, it did it did okay, and then obviously Nintendo outsold it. But I'm not. I wasn't surprised. They had more options. They had better games. That's what it came down to. That's what happened uh, in this generation with the PlayStation Four versus the Xbox uh, One. Is that PlayStation just had the better? Better games, better options. It's, that's it's pretty simple. Like that's that's what makes me buy a console is uh what what has the better options for me as a gamer, you know? That's why I have both. <laughs> All three, baby. I'm on a PC right now. All right, action. Let's go with action. We haven't done action. What well, prison? A violent prison game? No. It's, Stick to the PC. The PC looks like it's selling, alright. Prison time! Yeah. It's a badass game with 2D graphics. <laughs> Hoping to level that up soon. Action! We want gameplay all the fucking way. All the way. I can give it a little bit of engine. No quest. We don't need no quest here. You just run around shooting people and stabbing people and stuff. All right. Yeah, the PS the problem is the PS3 had so many games. And only like certain ones were selling really well and they just kept adding to the library. That's where P PlayStation was like falling off at the end of that console life was because they just kept they were like more games, more games. No, man. <laughs> That's not exactly how you do it. And then right at the end they had some really huge releases like Last The Last of Us was such a big deal for PlayStation. Because that was like one of the last games they came out with for that console. And it sold like 
nobody understood. It sold crazy. We want level design. Give a little bit of dialogue. People swearing at each other in the prison here. Now that I have an employee, this stuff should go higher and faster as well. Speed is really important because it gives more of these bubbles and you can get more stuff. So speed, speed and research are really important early on. Uh, world design. It's a, it's a prison. You know? It's a prison. It's a prison. How, how much world design do we need? It's a prison. In my mind, this is like hard time or something. I don't know if you've ever seen that game, but it's freaking ridiculous. Oh, God. Alright. Prison time is ready. <laughs> That's funny. Level up. Release. Oh, you know what I didn't do? I forgot to do marketing. I'm always going to forget. I have to remind myself. Seems like my numbers are high, though, so it's okay. Nine? Yeah. See, we didn't even need marketing there. Yeah, hard time is fucking hilarious. It's awful like the M. Dickey uh, engine or whatever he called it. The kid that made that wrestling game, he made a prison game. It's so funny. It's ridiculously stupid in the best way possible. Alright, what's the best, like... Which one is speed? Is this one? I feel like it was this one. Not, eh. Dun, 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 dun. Do a play test here. We should be able to get that. Come on. That should be easy. Get a couple extra bucks in my pocket. Well done. Alright. We need a new topic. Hunting. Oh, thank God. Can we also get... Oh, no. Okay, we can't do both at the same time. We'll do this and then we'll do that other thing. Medium games are like bigger than small games. Think of that. What genius level intellect I just had. <laughs> I just said like the most generic shit. That's what I do though. That's what I do. No, we don't want to train you. We want to research medium games. And we don't ever have to do that again. Medium games cost more though. I guess that's the negative, right? Hey, 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 hey. Ah, 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 develop new game. Here we go. Pick topic. Hunting is... Hunting? We want a hunting adventure game. How about that? Hunting adventure. We'll try it. It won't work, but we'll try it. We're sticking to the PC. PC Master Race. Shoot the thing. That's what it's called. Shoot the thing. It's an adventure. It's 2D graphics. Hi, dog. I have followed the progress of your games. A publisher market will publish your games. Okay. We know all about that. We don't want that shit over here. Engine. Do adventure games have story? I feel like we'll go like halfway with all of these. This might be the worst game yet. Marketing. Okay. Advertise in magazines. Do it. That'll cost money, but we'll sell better at the end. And it'll build hype. You gotta have hype. People are hyped for for Shoot the Thing. It's an adventure game with uh, really good level design. Here we go. <laughs> this could be a failure. I, I don't know why I like doubt myself so much right now with this game. Everyone has Monster Hunter but me! I 
Alright. <laughs> Adventure game. World design. I wasn't into Monster Hunter. I feel like a lot of people are kind of just bandwagoning it. Bandwagoning it right now because it's popular. You know? I wasn't super into it. And I tried the beta and I was like, it's okay. It doesn't... I don't get it. I don't know. It feels like super repetitive. You go kill a monster and then five seconds later you kill another monster and then you... C Seems like an endless loop of killing the same things. Here we go. Release the game. We had some hype behind this one, so we'll see how it reviews and sells. Shoot the thing has high scores. Here we go. Nine. Great. Another nine. Almost perfect. Nine. Nine all around. Nine. Nine. Eight. Okay. Love it. He loves it. Somebody loves my game. This proof right there. Adventure games work well on the PC. See, I doubted myself I shouldn't have done that because now it's all working out. I have a knack for security. Security upgrades. Uh, that sounds like... Fine. We'll do it. I don't know. Sometimes those things. You never know. New topic. History. <laughs> this, these ones are so bad. Business. Ew. That sounds boring. A business game? A history game? A law game? Like, what the fuck? Yes, technology. That's what I wanted. Gotta train her in technology. Knowledge. Gotta get that knowledge. <sighs> Gonna wait till this sells. Send her on vacation. Get that back up to green all the way. Shoot, the thing is off the market. Nintendo, the popular SNES console, the Super S Tess. We might buy a contract for that. We might, just to change it up a bit. Because we have this. And we have this. And we have this. Which seems to be doing the best. So. A medium game. Topic. Is law. Strategy. Let's do a strategy game. That's not going to work on that, is it? No. Casual. Dance game. Casual music game? On the game link? Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Text-based text -based music game. Fuck. That's not gonna work. Alright, law, strategy. Uh, let's go with the PC. Law and order. Here we go. E for everyone. Let's at least get to development stage one before we hype it, right? Okay, dog. Now we can select staff to work on certain parts of the game. Her design is really good. So... It's a strategy game. We want uh, the gameplay to be really good. Stories barely exist here. 
That's why we're gonna have to hire a new person after this game. That's my uh, next goal here. And we can build. Let's uh, let's go to magazines. It's a medium game, Law and Order. Okay, so we don't want to overstaff these people, but I have to hire people here first. So me on this, me on this, and then her right here, Clara Castro. Feel like those can. Uh, I feel like level design isn't important in strategy. AI is. I'm gonna overwork myself. This uh, super test has been revealed and released to the world. Okay. Yeah, I'm in the red now, baby. All right. Sound is not important. World design might... Maybe a little bit. Graphics. Yeah, we're gonna be super tired, but it's okay. Because we can take a big break after this one. Couple of good games really turn this around, you know? That's, that's the... The idea is you sell a couple good games and then people will respect you. Here we go. Release that shit. Law and order. Oh boy, I saw some low numbers here. Ah, this could have been better. It's a medium game too, so... They're going to be more strict about it. Sevens. Focus on gameplay. Serve well. Strategy games work well on the PC. Yeah, see, I knew the Game Boy was a bad idea. Complex. How about game demo? I want someone that's good at technology. There we go. Mary Holt. Train you. And we have crazy research points. You go on... Uh, oh, shit. I can't send you on vacation? God damn it. They respond to new topics all the time. Vony... The Vony... Just making a new console. Okay. CD ROMs. CD ROMs are a big deal here in the future. Instead of cartridge games, what losers? Research custom game engine. That's going to take all my research. But we need it. We need it. Very successful, let me know. Alright, medium sized contracts. Popular is new topics as well, but we can't afford that right now, so this is our break. We're still making money from Law and Order, so this is the time to do it. Just upgrading, moving forward to the future here. Bum bum dun 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 Look at this. That's going to change the way we do things. Do So we need research to add this stuff. Um, under contract work, we should be able to do this with three people. Is she doing it? Is she helping? Not really. We got three research points from this. What the fuck? Why are you, like, exhausted? Okay, so we need, like, 15. Could we maybe do a publishing deal? 
Hacking RPG. Music action. That sounds like a terrible combination. Jesus. Minimum score of five. I think we could do that. Let's do it. That's super. That's super Tess. Yeah. Published game. That way I remember what it is. Start development. Okay, we'll spend some money on marketing too. It, I could go negative here as well. Alright, she is the technology lady. So she should be on engine. RPGs have stories, gameplay. Engine's not that important. We'll give it a little bit of engine. It's because it's on a new system. I don't know if it works that way, but... We'll do magazine. There's like no hype on this game. Alright, she needs to be there. Dialogues? Be like nothing. It's an RPG. I feel like that's level design is important. Oops, sorry, clicked the wrong button there. Okay. Bugs. Law and Order had some bugs. Would I like to spend the money? How do I do that? Develop a patch for 60k. Technology is in... World design, I believe? He's developing a patch as well. It's not a good time to be doing that. <laughs> but I can't stop the game product. You know, I have to keep making that game. Game production has to continue here at the published game that we're getting paid to do. We can't get below a f a five. So. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, we have research to make the uh, game engine now. So. She got a raise after that for her normalized I love companies like under games they don't just milk their customers that's what you think <laughs> game review uh oh please uh oh okay six okay five they shouldn't forget about dialogues shit oh Minimum score, it's a five, and there was fives there. They can't be mad about that. The game meets required ratings. Yeah. Should we hire another person? Let's do it. Let's do that first. I think training is free anyway, so. Oh, jeez. It's like so much technology here. Hire that guy. Train. Hold on. Clicking you to train you. Stealth, staff welcoming. Costs money, but it's f no no research cost here. Send on vacation. She's overworked. Okay, guys. Let let him finish his training. Let the game run out, and then we'll, we'll do something cool. <laughs> Is he done? Okay. Let's research. Game tutorials. That's important. 
you can research simple cutscenes. Let's add some more level to our games now. They're actually gonna be games. I don't know who was buying our trash before. <laughs> So with all those things, you can add them into the game, and then once you get a actual like software engine or like a game engine, you can add those things automatically, and they'll always be there. But it costs a lot of money to do that, and a lot of research. So we're just gonna develop a new game, or we could do it now, but no. We're just gonna do a new game. We don't have new topics. We're gonna stick with zombies, action. Let's let's do something easy. Um, platform, Super Nintendo. That's what I'm calling it, even though that's not what the game calls it. Um, undead. Z blast. Blaster. I couldn't think of anything other than something super generic. 2D graphics. There we go, boys. Looks like I'm gonna need a graphics upgrade as well here next time. You can go to G3. Speaking of uh, conventions, I am going to PAX East this year. So I have to pay for parking. That's fun. <laughs> I have to pay for gas and parking and food. All three are ridiculously expensive for Boston. Well, gas isn't. Gas is cheap here. For now. We'll see how it goes. Okay. Engine is not important. Gameplay is the most important thing in the world. A little bit of engine there. Need to remind myself to upgrade graphics. That's going to be a big deal. Kilton Gillen. I'll do an interview. Many of our readers are curious about what decisions go into making a video game. How do, how do companies prioritize development in areas? Your new game is a zombie slash action game. Well, that's more on sound, really. You want to hear the guns shooting and the zombies growling or whatever the fuck moaning? Dog said that sound. Professionals agree. Yeah, see, I know what I'm talking about. I'm going to build some hype, too, with a demo. Level design. I got yelled at for no dialogue, so this time I'm going to have a little bit of dialogue. Even though it's not about that. Undead Blaster. It's like the most generic game. It's the kind of game that sells really well. Alright. This new guy's going to work here. Yeah. Put him to work. I said sound was important, so I gotta make sound important. He wasn't even working on the game till I selected him. Because I forgot about it. <laughs> I can't lie to you guys. Uh, gotta wait till these bugs are finished out. She's overworked. Sent her on vacation. That should be a record for design right there. Yeah. There we go. Ding, 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 ding. Better AI? No, we need graphics, dude. Where is graphics? I uh, have better graphics. Open world games. That's important. RPG games. Do we want a small booth? Yeah, let's do it since it's my first year doing it. Undead Blaster is going to do so bad and I'm going to have it out in the booth. People are going to be like, this game sucks. <laughs> this game is trash, dude. Uninspiring, oh boy. Because RPGs are popular, man. By the time I make a new game, that's going to run out, so it's not even worth doing. Character progression? That's a lot of RP. Evolution? The fuck? Sure. 
That's so random. Bum, 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 bum. Under games. Let's see how many people show up to my shit. I knew there was a way to skip this, and I don't know how to do it. 49,000 people. That's crazy. It's like a whole arena. That'll help boost my sales, right? Today, Vony has announced the play system. Mystery and history, baby. Let's do fashion. No, let's do better dialogues. Yeah. Dun, dun. Ooh, was that sequels? Did that say sequels? Did that just say sequels? Sequels is 20. I have an idea. I want everyone to work on setup computers. Get some extra cash and hopefully enough research. Nope. The play system. We have to buy something for that. We have to publish games for that. Do we want Air Force One? Nah. Let them. I don't care about that game. They can do what they want to that game. See, that's how you do the new engine stuff, but I want I want sequels, man. I really want sequels. <sighs> Guess we'll just make a new game. That'll build a ton of research. Small game for young kids. It's going to be about evolution. It's going to teach them apes became man. It's going to teach them all about evolution. <laughs> it's like the word. the dumbest shit. It's a simulation game like Spore? No, it's just casual. It's going to do terrible. But 200,000. It's going to be on the PlayStation. Play system. The worst graphics ever. Apes became man. It's like the dumbest shit I've ever heard. Gameplay is the most important thing ever. There's hype. Your legal department has advised you to stop us. 